Uh, innovation in India is not very uncommon. Uh, in fact, uh, uh, around the corner, at the bottom of the pyramid in the society, uh, uh, very innovative and entrepreneurial, whether it is the Dabawalas in Bombay or whether there is a very innovative idea of bicycle repair, you will find that this has to be translated into the world of education. Unfortunately, the Indian education is becoming very, very hard, very stratified, and to some extent very fossilized. And therefore, there is a need for innovation as a spirit to be brought into the educational world in India. And my role and my responsibility, as I feel in the Innovation Council, National Innovation Council, would be to see to it that the universities, the colleges, the schools are getting transformed through this spirit of innovation. And in order to do that, at least to begin with, we would like to set up 20 innovation centers in the country, which are within the universities, but they're not exclusively within one academic institution. Maybe a group of academic institutions together will form a cluster. The concept of a cluster is extremely important in innovation, and we feel that even in the universities, these clusters are very important. Alto University in Finland is a very good example of such a cluster. And we would like to have our own version, our own solution as to how the university system can be transformed. And by bringing in that uh, the students will create the IPs, there will be ideas that the students will develop, there will be training so that they can develop things in a manner by which innovation and subsequently leading to entrepreneurship will happen in the Indian academic world. That is my passion and that is what I'm going to drive in the National Innovation Council.